Hello there. I don't even know you were up there. Hi, baby. You got your harness on and your collar. Oh my, what is this? Poor little baby. <laughs> Just putting them in their harnesses one last time before we leave so that they're adjusted to their size because I did have to increase Midna's a little bit around the belly because it's actually been a little while since I put their harnesses on them. Hey. Hey you, you're messing with mommy's nail polish. Anyway, I'm gonna try to show my face as few times as possible throughout this vlog because <laughs> I haven't showered or anything because I want to shower tonight so that I don't have to in the morning because we have to leave at like 4 to 4.30 a.m. So um, I wanted to just shower and have everything ready tonight. So I'm just holding off on today's shower till later. So I feel like extra nasty. <laughs> I put on clean underwear, but I still feel like gross. It's just, I feel like I'm soiling my clothes. <laughs> anyway, so today I'm editing some final toy videos. I got up three videos today because it's Friday. And um, just have to fold laundry so we can pack, just kind of tidy up the apartment so it's not a disaster when we get back, that kind of stuff. Just packing and prepping for when we go home for Christmas. So, yes and making sure everything is in order. Right, little baby? Oh yeah, you look, you're so good with your harness on. Such a good baby. Oh, see you later. So excluding today's toy video, um, I need four more to be edited so that I'll have enough for when I'm gone. Okay, I don't want to break my nail polish. Ugh. This one's going to be a Choco Santa. Ooh, yeah. I almost feel chocolated out, to be honest, between like all the advent calendars plus the Kinder chocolate from the Kinder eggs I opened. Even though I've been getting help eating the chocolate, it's still so much. So I'm probably not gonna eat him right now. He'll just chill. Well, look, they're all ready for travel. <laughs> I just zipped them up and carried them around a little bit. That should be popped up like that to give you some more space. But you babies always squish it down like this. I feel like these carriers would be too small once they're full grown. They do have larger sizes. I've seen the large in person. It's way too large. Like that will not fit under an airplane seat. I wonder if a medium would be better. It's just kind of a shame. Like, I don't know. The carriers aren't the cheapest. So maybe once they're full grown, we won't even travel with them anymore. Who knows? That would mean this is their only travel trip. But, um, yeah, I feel like a full grown cat would not fit comfortably in here like they'd be kind of forced to lay down and stay laying down and stuff so I don't know either we'd probably upgrade to the medium size or just not travel anymore I don't know maybe we'll take you if we drive home that might happen sometimes I'd be scared to do that in the winter because like there's really windy roads through the mountains. You guys saw some of that footage when I went to Banff. I filmed the scary roads. <laughs> Imagine that in winter. No thank you. <laughs> but if I ever feel like driving there during the summer, like make it a little road trip, I could bring kitties. I just feel bad that they have to ride in the vehicle for that long. <laughs> for like 13 to 15 hours. I have to figure out a name tag situation. Is this twisted? No, no, it's not. I have to figure out a name tag situation for them because I think I might do something that's on their collars and on their harnesses because they don't always wear both. So, yeah. Because I'd feel bad having them in their harnesses when they're in the carrier, but we kind of need them to have it on because we have to take them through security and like take the cats out of the bags at security as far as I know from my research. <laughs> so it'd be kind of nice to have their harnesses to grab them by and stuff so they don't like freak out and try to run away. But I wouldn't want to make them stay in the harness like forever. And for sure once we land and when my sister picks us up I'll take their harnesses off but maybe for the airplane portion leave them on. Just seems a little uncomfortable having to be in the carrier plus wearing the harness. It just seems not the funnest, huh, baby? 
It's nice because the liners are movable, so if they poop or something, we can clean it. See, that's a good size for a little baby like you, huh? Maybe not for a big cat. But would a bigger bag fit under an airplane seat? That's why I'm curious to see when we take these ones. I want to see how easily they fit under the seats because if they have to squish, then a bigger carrier is not going to help that much, although it will be probably a bit wider. But either way, the carrier would still have to squish to fit under the seat. So we'll see how that goes. This is a little experiment, huh, Kitty Cat? So this last little while has been a whirlwind of like my video going live at one o'clock and then um kind of like coordinating things with jelly bean and we were on skype and like watching each other's videos and like responding to everything and being like ah. <laughs> and uh, i also just signed up for reship which is like a service that it gives you a u.s shipping address so when you go to buy something that's u.s only or maybe it's something where it's free shipping to US, but then it's gonna be like 40 shipping to Canada or something like that. Um, you can use this reship service to get stuff shipped to you. So I signed up for that and I got the Tsum Tsum subscription box from the Disney store, cause that's US only. And I tried signing up for that like um, over a month ago and um, it wouldn't let me, so. Now I can and I did, so I'm excited for that. So that'll definitely come in handy for certain purchases. And yeah, now we're here. It was kind of like a whirlwind, plus I was like, best to take this person. And blah, blah, blah. It was like a million things going on at once and like doing my social media posts. So oh, I haven't done Facebook yet for the new video I put out, but that's actually good for me to space it out a little. Sometimes I just do them back to back to get them out of the way, but. Maybe I'll do that post later in the day. And now I gotta go back to the computer and keep editing. Sorry, this is gonna be like a pretty boring vlog because I'm gonna be editing all day, but I'll try to show like packing stuff and like trying to make it interesting. I guess I have a lot of days that aren't interesting, so I shouldn't complain about it. But I know a lot of people agree that just the little everyday things can be interesting and I agree with that with vlogs. Like it's fun to see travel vlogs and things like that sometimes, but I always feel relieved when the, the vlogger's back home and it's back to like their normal everyday life. For some reason that's a little more interesting to me, so yeah. Too cute, look at these babies. They're matching each other, laying the same way. Oh, cute. Okay, I've got all videos going. Here's a little preview of what's to come on the toy channel. We've got Kawaii Box. We've got the Breakthrough Booster Box Part 2. Um, then we have Snow Globes and Kinder Eggs and then Simpsons Lego minifigures. So that's what will be uploaded while I am gone. It's time for the SpongeBob joke of the day. Why did SpongeBob wash the reef? He was practicing good coral hygiene. <laughs> what are you babies doing in there? Always going in any kind of boxy thing you find. Yeah, you wish your carrier was this big, you'd have lots of room. Kiki was actually just in her carrier, just laying in there. So, they obviously don't mind it, until we take them out of the house. I didn't even realize she was in there just now. Look at all the space you got, baby. Yeah, this makes it look huge when you look at it like this. When she just curls up at the back? Yeah, it's not the tallest, but when they curl up, they've got a lot of space. Oh, baby. <laughs> Midna's like, I don't know if I like it as much as Kiki does. Are you giving me a crybaby? Probably both would be whiny once we leave the apartment. Hopefully they'll be done whining by the time we get on the plane. Now you're squishing your sister. Oh man, there's still dishes to do. And I still have to edit this vlog that you're watching right now. It's 11 p.m. I need to be up at 3.30. These definitely need to get done. Is this clean? Yeah, I'll have to empty this first and then I'll just load it up and start it. Well, actually, no. I'll wait till we have breakfast. I don't know if we're really gonna have breakfast. Maybe, I don't know, probably. <laughs> we have like some apples and carrots and like oatmeal, so I don't know. <laughs> we didn't get to clean the apartment, so it's still a huge 
mess, but whatever. It seems like all our stuff will fit in a shared suitcase along with all the presents. Um, it's just a matter of whether it's not, it's going to be overweight. We'll have to wait till we toss in our toiletries in the morning to find out. And then we might, we might have to put some stuff in our carry on. So we'll see how that goes. BBs, you're like your carrier now. You're not going to like it later when you take you outside into weird places. And I keep pushing the tops down. It's squishing the poor kicky. Anyway, I'm not showing my face because I just showered and then like I epilated my sideburns and above my eyebrows, so my face is super red. <laughs> Don't look at me. So, yeah, I think I'm going to end the vlog here though because I need to edit it. So, yes. Oh, oh, also a disclaimer. This could be the last vlog you see for several days. Um, I will be staying at my mom's house for one night, so I might get up one more, maybe. It depends on our schedule, but then I'm going to my dad's house for four nights, and he does not have Wi-Fi at the farm, so as always, when I travel to the farm, I can't upload vlogs, so um, I will upload, like, I'll still film, and I'll upload them when I get back to my mom's house, so yeah, and I might end up grouping some, like, two days into one video or something, just so it's easier to get caught up. Um, but yeah, I guess that's all I really have to say for now. We're going to be traveling early in the morning. Yay! How cute. So, yeah, I'm going to go edit this vlog. So, thank you guys so much for watching, and I'll see you maybe tomorrow. If not, then I'll see you, like, the night of Christmas Eve or Christmas Day. So, bye! Ooh! It's another one from Shannon. Hi, Bailey. These are just a little something to celebrate your new toy channel. Enjoy. Oh, thank you so much. Oh, beast. Beast. Yes. <laughs> thank you so much. You know my taste so well. Anna and the 